Well, hello again, everyone. Professor Prophet coming to you from Karaps University. And in today's video, we're going to uh, have the world premiere of our Nifty 50 system. Now, uh, this is a nice system for uh, the low roller. And this is the third in our series of bubble crap strategies. So this is one you can play at the bubble craps machine and uh, hopefully walk away with a few extra dollars in your pocket. Uh, this is one that uh, I took from the roulette table. This is a, similar to a betting strategy that I use for the, the roulette game. And I've had a lot of success with it uh, at the roulette table. And of course, uh, craps and roulette are not very similar. But uh, uh, this is as close as I can get to betting like you would a roulette game. And I've rolled this out a few times, had some success with it. I have not uh, tried it at the actual casino yet, so uh, buyer beware on that. But uh, the simulations I've done on the Crapsy software um, have, by and large, been very successful. So pretty excited to roll this out for you. So let's uh, uh, go on down to the felt here shortly, and we'll roll out the Nifty 50. And it only requires a $500 buy-in. So we'll head down to the virtual felt now, the Crapsy software, and uh, explain how this system works, the mechanics of it, and then we'll roll it out and see if we have a winner here. So we'll see you on the felt here shortly. Talk to you there. Okay, everybody down here on the felt, getting ready to roll out our Nifty 50 system. Uh, this system uh, requires a $500 buy-in. Uh, you see our bank roll up in the top right corner. So the way this works, after we get a number established, we put a $10 place bet on the 6 and the 8, and a $5 field bet. And we'll roll that until uh, we hit a 7. And once we hit a 7, uh, we'll step up to 20, 20, and 10. it will be $20 on the 6 and 8, and 10 on the field. If we 7 out again, then we go up to 30, 30, and 15. And the field bet is half of the place bet on the 6 or the 8. It's kind of how you can keep track of that. Now, um, steps are uh, 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50 on the 6 and 8. And then on the field, 5, 10, 15, 20, and 25. So we call it Nifty 50 because once you get a $50 profit, uh, everything comes down. And we walk away with $50 in our pocket. Call it a session. Now, on the downside, if we get to the 50, 50, 25 level on our place bets and field bet and lose there, uh, we also walk away and just uh, figure it's not our day and take our loss and step away from the table, or in this case, the bubble craps machine. And that helps us avoid what I call the death spiral. Once you uh, start losing at that level, um, you can eat up your bankroll pretty quick. So this is just a way to protect your bankroll if you have a... a uh, level at which you're going to call it a day, a stop loss. So $500 buy-in, and if you're like me, you have trouble remembering, keeping up with it, uh, just take a pen and uh, paper with you and write down what your starting level is. And that'll make it easy to do the math and figure out um, when you get to that $50 profit level. So let's go ahead and get a number established. As you can see, we're using the Crapsy software again. and uh, that way it'll uh, figure our winnings to, to the penny, and that's what we're looking for. So we get the uh, 10 easy on the come out roll, so let's uh, put a $10 place bet on the 6 and the 8, and $5 on the field. And there's your 11, so off to a good start. And we're trying to get to 550 on this session. And there's the 10 easy, so that's a winner 10. So we're going to go ahead and take our field bet down because we don't want it working on the come out roll. And the place bets, of course, are off. But now I wish I'd left it up. All right, next roll. Okay, and there's the uh, front line winner. Take the don'ts. 6-1. And back on that 10. This time it's the sunflowers, the 10 hard. And we get our, get our field bet back up. And there's six easy, the five one. So we lose our field bet. We do win a little over $11 on our six, uh, place bet on that six. And there's double on the bubble there as we hit that field bet. 
So that's another 10. And the next row. And there's another field winner, the Yo 11. So that puts us at 531. And there's center field 9, the Colt 45. So another field winner. It's three in a row on the field. And there's six hard. We do lose the field on that one, but we win uh, 11 on, a little over $11 on the six. So we're we'll replaced that field bet. And uh, looking for another hit here. And there's the 314. And so we're sitting at 548. And if I'm sitting at that bubble crafts machine, I'm cashing this out, saying that's good enough for me. So we're going to cash out at this point. And walk away a $48 winner. And we'll walk around the casino, watch the people, go to the bar, go get something to eat, do a little shopping, just take a break for a little bit, half an hour or so, and then we'll come back and find another machine. So on this one, we're starting at the 548 level. Um, we've already got a number established here. So um, that's from the last session. Let's go ahead and get this cleared out and we'll roll this till we hit the 10 or the 7 and there's a 7 so let's get a new number established and we're looking for $598 to cash out and there's our come out 325 so we'll go 10 on the 6 as we start our next session here 5 on, on the 6 and the 8 10 on the 6, 10 on the 8, 5 on the field is what I'm trying to say. It's not so easy for me. All right, there's 5, 1, 6 easy. So we went on the 6, we lose the field, so we'll replace that in our next row. And back-to-back 6s. -back so we'll rinse and repeat. Place that field bet. And there's another 6. This time it's uh, 6 hard. Once again, we'll replace that field bet. And there's the winner five, so we lose the field. And the uh, place bets are off on the next come out roll. We'll leave the field bet down. We don't want anything working on the come out roll. So here's that roll. And that's the three, two, another five. So back up with our $5 bet on the field. Since it was the 5 and not the 7 out, we don't uh, increase our bets on the 5 when we lose, just the field bet, only on uh, big red. So we'll leave it at the 10, 10, 5 level. And uh, next roll is a 6, 4. That's the 10 easy. And so that puts us at 5, 68. And there's Joe 11, another field winner. And keep on rolling. The Nifty 50 system. There's the Colt 45, that would be the center field 9. So that's three field hits in a row. Let's see if we can keep it rolling. There's a 314, we can, all right. So that puts us at 583. And another 10 easy, 64. Next roll. Oh, and there's a 7 out. So we got within $10 of our goal and seven out. So we're at 563 now. Let's get another number established. And that's the 4-3. That's the front line winner. We'll take the don'ts on that roll. Next roll. And there's three craps. So that's the front line loser on that one. And we pay the don'ts on that. And there's our number. That's the 5-3. That's the 8 easy. So uh, we lost at the $10 level, so we'll come up to the $20 level. 20, 20, and 10. And there's a point seven out, so that eats you up pretty quick. That puts us at 513 now. So let's get another number established. Now this is similar to a system that I use playing roulette. Uh, I've had a lot of luck with, with a similar system on the roulette table. Of course, roulette and craps are, are not alike, uh, not very similar at all. Uh, but I tried to adapt this as best I could and see how it works out. And it's worked out pretty well uh, in simulation. I haven't actually tried it at a casino yet. But so far, it's something that I, I will consider giving it a shot. I'll do a few more uh, trials, of course, and see if it continues to be successful. 
So we just set a point seven out, which always hurts. So we got a number established, which was the uh, six easy. And so we'll increase our bets to 30, 30, and 15. And here's our come out roll. And that's a six two, that's the eight easy. So that's a, a winner there. We'll replace that $15 field bet. And our next roll. And there's the field winner, that's the four hard, the double deuces. And our next roll. And that's 5-1, that's a 6 easy, that's the uh, winner. So we'll leave our field bet down, place bets are off, we get another number established. And there's the 3-2, no field 5. So now we'll come back up with a $15 field bet. And here we go. And there's a 6-2, that's another 8 easy. So that puts us at 588, we're just $10 away from our goal. So what I would do at this point, just to uh, control the variance a little bit, uh, I'm going to go ahead and reduce our bets back down. We need, uh, need to win $10. So um, let's reduce it down to 10, 10, 5, which is our base level. And we could go 20, 20, 10. And uh, matter of fact, let's do that. Let's do 20, 20, 10. And that way, if we can get a hit here, uh, that should uh, we should reach our goal and there's the eight easy and let's see if that'll get us there yes it does 601 is our uh, our total now so that's a uh, better than fifty dollar win about fifty three dollars so at this point we would go uh, down with our bets and walk away from this session once again uh, uh, take a walk around the casino hit the shops hit the bar go to the restaurant just do something for a few minutes and then we can come back and try that again so that is how the nifty 50 system works i hope you enjoyed that um, it doesn't always go uh, this well but uh, we didn't have a whole lot of turbulence on either one of these sessions and uh, put a benjamin in our pocket so this is a good system i think for the uh, low roller somebody who likes to play the bubble crafts machine this is one you can uh, and give it a shot and hopefully have some success with it. So um, please leave a comment if you would uh, have some ideas on how to tweak this system to make it even better. Uh, I would entertain hearing that and enjoy getting some feedback on it. Uh, if you like the video, please give us the old thumbs up on that. That makes us feel good and lets us know you're enjoying uh, the content that we're putting out. And finally, if uh, you haven't subscribed to the channel, uh, please do so at this time. We would really appreciate it. We'd love having you uh, be part of the Craps University student body. And besides it's, besides, it's just not the same whenever you're not here with us. So uh, consider subscribing. Uh, absolutely no cost to you. And we put out one of these videos every Sunday and um, try to do that pretty religiously. So once again, this is Professor Prophet coming to you from Craps University. And if you're out there rolling those bones this week, we wish you nothing but the best of luck. And may all your rolls be winners. We'll talk to you again next Sunday. Bye-bye.